Hi everyone, welcome back to the Vision Refocus channel where we discuss all things eye health and vision related. I'm Dr. Kevin Cornwell, and today I wanted to answer one of the most common questions we get from patients, and that is, what is a normal eye pressure? Our eye pressure is determined by the balance between fluid production and fluid outflow inside our eye. Inside our eye, there's a fluid called the aqueous humor that's produced to bring nutrients to the eye. It's produced at a structure called the ciliary body, and it drains at a structure called the trabecular meshwork. Normal eye pressure is typically between 10 and 20. However, it's not uncommon to see patients with pressures lower than that, 7, 8, 9, and that's still okay, or pressures higher than that, 21, 22, and 23. There are many factors that can cause somebody to have an elevated eye pressure. These can include age, diabetes, certain medications, or a history of cataracts or a history of eye trauma. We use various techniques in clinic to measure patients' eye pressure. And the readings from each of these methods is highly dependent on the thickness of a patient's cornea. So in other words, patients with thinner corneas can have artificially lower eye pressures, while patients with thicker corneas can have artificially elevated eye pressures. And our primary concern with elevated eye pressure is to make sure patients don't develop glaucoma and lose vision unnecessarily. We've done a few other videos in the past on glaucoma, which we'll be sure to link below. If you have any further questions on eye pressure, feel free to leave a comment and we will get back to you. Also, if you have any ideas for eye-related topics you'd like to see covered in a future video, please let us know as well. Thanks again for watching and we'll see you in the next video.